Hi guys. So today the, we'll go into uh, the most uh, popular topic there ever is, love. <laughs> so today I wanted to um, do the speaker card about um, what is your person dreaming about you. <laughs> So it could be that you are in separation, it could be even if you know you are whatever stage of relationship you are in, let's see what this person dreams about you, <laughs> okay? Um, so in front of you are four piles, pile number one, two, three, and four, okay? So pile number one is the yellow stone, <clears throat> pile number two is the white stone, Pile number three is the blue stone and pile number four is the orange stone. Okay, so please pause your videos and uh, pick a pile that you're attracted to. All right, let's start. All right, pile number one. What is your person dreaming about you? It's the yellow stone. The emperor. True love. Ten of hearts or ten of cups, culmination. Uh, seven of Cups, uh, Eight of Wands, and uh, Queen of Cups, uh, sorry, Queen of Swords. All right, interesting pile. What is your person dreaming about you? I'm getting a lot of things here. I let me see yeah all right so I don't know which stage of relationship you guys are in right now but what I'm seeing here is that um, your person is basically uh, you know I think you are a little standoffish with your person um, you know, with the Queen of Swords, what I'm getting is possibly you are, you know, uh, you're not yet in a relationship or something. Or even if you are, there might have been some confusion or some non-communication or you're just a little, you know, uh, cheesed off about something. So I feel that your person, uh, actually, I don't know why, but I'm getting the, an energy here. That your person is really attracted to this aloof uh, and standoffish version of you. They really like it. They think about that a lot. Okay. And for them, it's, uh, you know, like what they are dreaming of is to woo you in this really beautiful way here with the seven of cups. Uh, this is the <clears throat> romantic tarot. So the cards are different. Uh, so it's like, you know, the feeling I get is that they probably want to, uh, you know, like mm, not reveal their identity and try to woo you. Okay. Because this guy is wearing a mask. All right. And it's possible that, you know, like <laughs> uh, you guys are not in a relationship or something and um, or they just want to have a surprise element so that, you know, you don't uh, sort of block them off or something like that. So this person is actually thinking of how to woo you, impress you, um, you know, in a, a sort of hidden way. Okay, it's possibly it could be through messages or, you know, or phones or something anonymous is what I'm getting. Okay, uh, and it's a very gentle energy here, uh, meaning that, um, you know, uh, it's like, this person uh, wants to slowly open you up to this, uh, to, to your feelings because you are closed off, I feel. You're very guarded. 
uh, and this person wants to slowly bring you in into this love all right because what i'm sensing from this pile is this person is like really uh, you know like this person wants something lasting okay and that is also something that they're dreaming of they want to be the the emperor for you the uh, the provider the protector and there's a very gentle energy of trying to woo you uh, to come into uh, this relationship. So they're actually, I think, thinking of various ways. They're dreaming of various ways that they can impress you and uh, get you to notice them or get you to notice this love. Now, if you've partnered, I feel maybe there has been, you know, you, you know some sort of a dispute or something and this person is you know, trying to uh, sort of, you know, uh, think about how it is that they can get you out of your shell because, um, you know, <laughs> I think they miss you a lot. And so they're dreaming about how they can get you to open up, to become more emotional with them. For some of you, I also feel with the Ten of Hearts uh, that you might be spouses, okay? Uh, so it's possible uh, that, you know, they just want things to come back on track for your love to flow. And uh, I think they're trying to figure out ways to sort of open you up and make you flow uh, with your emotions, okay? Uh, with the Eight of Wands, I feel they want to do this like really quickly and actually to be very frank, what I'm getting is that they want to have some physical union with you, okay? They want to take it slow, yes, okay? But they also want passion. <laughs> I am getting here with the Eight of Wands. Uh, this is, a, a, you know, a card of uh, rapid communication. So it's possible they want this soon. They're dreaming about making this happen soon or they want to have physical passion with you a lot. Okay. <laughs> I won't get into that too much because this is, you know, um, not that kind of reading. But I really sense that this person is dreaming about, you know, uh, like just having you over and expressing their love physically to you once they have uh, wooed you, once they have convinced you, uh, you know, that, uh, that everything is fine and that they love you and that they will provide for you and that you are the one for them. Okay. Now, I also feel this person is dreaming about you being their true love. All right, with this card, I feel this person even dreams uh, that, you know, uh, you are their other half, your th their mirror soul or their soulmate. Because, you know, I'm seeing a reflection here uh, and, and I feel that, you know, uh, it's like this person possibly even wants to talk to you about this concept. So I don't know, even if they uh, don't want to talk to you about this concept, they just want to reach out to you to tell you that, you know, um, their love is true and, uh, you know, they, they are actually dreaming about you, uh, you know, having this kind of true love for them, actually. They are, they are wanting you to realize that, you know, uh, that you're, you also love them or, or they wish that you also could love them if you are not in a partnership. Uh, but yes, this this person is dreaming of true love. I mean, with all of these cards, I sense that, you know, you are a little closed off or, <clears throat> you know, not very, um, not very uh, open or not very, um, you know, you're very, very, you're very, you know, about this person, I feel, okay? You are not opening up and this person really, you know, wants you to realize that, they really do love you. It's not all about passion or anything. They really want this Ten of Hearts, the Ten of Cups. They want to provide for you. They want the dreaming of having you in their life um, and, and kind of, you know, like keeping you with so much love. I mean, if you see this card here, She's got hearts all over her body, you know. So it's, it's yeah, to me, this is giving once again a feeling of passion, okay. So they do want to, you know, like uh, make love to you. They want to show you their love uh, physically as well as, um, you know, uh, through emotions. 
and they are dreaming of this they are dreaming of having a life with you they are dreaming of wanting to be your knight in shining armor your uh, divine counterpart your emperor actually because they i feel sense somewhere or or even dream that you know uh, you guys are both a uh, perfect a perfect match yes so this person really wants everything with you i feel you know like and and there's no hurry i sense no hurry with this person i just feel that you know um they would be they are just dreaming of having this beautiful loving life with you all right i also sense for some of you this person is a little um you know uh like i think they i don't know if they've expressed their feelings for you but if they have they want to take it you know um a little you know step by step stage by stage because i sense that this person feels that you could get scared of or you could just block them out or something like that but this person is constantly thinking if you see this person's eyes you know they are closed and they are thinking about this star here uh, which is their goal actually and that is to get you into their life i'm really sensing with these cards it's almost like they want to give you so much love they want to give you so much love uh, they're thinking of just nourishing you with love all kinds i mean emotional physical everything they just i don't know the energy is so much about wanting and longing and needing and <laughs> I mean this person is just setting up like literally setting up a dream world around you. I don't know if you know you are that interested in the person. Obviously you're interested that's why you're you know like looking at this card. But this person has almost set up like a dream world uh, around you. They constantly think of you and it's almost like you know they want you to be theirs, you know, with the father card. and with these images here it's like they want to almost own you you know that's that's the kind of feeling i'm getting they want to be uh the person who um you reach out to all the time like you know they want to be the one in your life and they want to lavish you with affection lavish you with love lavish you with uh all kinds of love actually um even charm you uh, they think of that they dream of that all the time i feel you know with the 10 of hearts and the moon card i think in the night this person thinks a lot about you about how they want to set up probably a house with you you know how to just basically get you into their life that is a major thing i'm seeing here this person wants you in their life his or her life and it's like they've almost set up a dream world around them um you know where you know you are probably their true love and uh, you know they get to nourish you with all the attention and affection and everything uh that that they ever want like it's literally like with this card what i'm seeing is that you know they want to wake up in the morning with you drawing the windows uh, the curtains uh, out of the you know uh from the window it's like you know for them it's a very cozy feeling if you are in their place in their home so they dream about this you know that maybe one day i get up and this person's with me uh i'm uh you know wooing this per person maybe at a party uh i'm kind of charming this person i am being there for them you know i am being the provider of this person i am you know uh, going to be the true love of this person oh my god i mean so many dreams this person i think just keeps dreaming about you like a lot i feel okay and in fact i feel they're also in a bit of a manifestation mode here with this emperor card because this is a very stable energy i don't think this person with the 10 of hearts uh and the emperor card i don't think this person is someone that 
you know is is just dreaming you know they are manifesting i think they are going to do something if they haven't yet already done something i feel that it's because of the seven of cups energy and the queen of swords maybe you are a little you know standoffish or whatever it is you know this person is a little awkward they don't know how to proceed but i see a lot of love and passion here you know like physical passion emotional passion intensity okay and so many dreams you know about you being their true love and i really feel this person is going to try to manifest or convince you of their love they they really dream about convincing you that they love you a lot you know so i don't know i am getting more of the fact that you guys are not in a relationship in this spread uh but if you are maybe you are in separation or you're not talking to each other or something like that but i really feel this person wants something stable like a commitment like a marriage you know because they do feel they do dream about having this true love with you and the ten of cups with you you know like a family uh you know maybe a home children all of those things they want to be they dream of being your protector your provider you being their mate their spouse for life they they really have all that you know with all these cards this person is dreaming about a life with you a beautiful life where you know they have so much to offer um So yeah this is what I'm getting about what your person is dreaming about you and this is very powerful stuff so I don't know if you guys big stage you guys are at here but this person has very nice intentions about you very very genuine uh love is what I'm seeing and I do see love here uh pile number 1 okay so please I hope you know this uh, kind of gave you some sort of insight about your person and maybe you can take decisions accordingly but yeah that person really really loves you okay now with the with group number 2 with the white stone let's see the empress fear hope uh six of swords two of pentacles and uh six of pentacles so we have two sixes here so let's see okay so the very first thing i'm getting about what your person is dreaming about you i think they dream about <laughs> okay i uh, feel that they find you very beautiful they they constantly dreaming about you constantly thinking about how beautiful how soft how feminine how elegant and graceful and charming you are i feel they dream a lot about your beauty maybe even think about the times when you looked resplendent you know um there's just this uh feeling with the empress card here uh that this person just feels that you are the one okay they they this is their feeling like i don't think they look at anybody else they're not looking at anyone else and uh they just feel you are the most beautiful thing that they ever saw all right uh now with the with this empress card i'm also getting that um you know they the, there's a spouse energy here it's it's almost like you know they want to protect you they feel that you're very fragile and so they think of protecting you of of dispelling all your fears because I don't know why I'm getting a very a uh, fragile sort of energy with this fear card and the empress card and so I am feeling you know like this person wants to be like your knight in shining armor and uh, come and you know release you from all the fears that you've ever had because I sense you're a little 
scared about something maybe about this connection or maybe in general you're just a very reticent person uh so i really am feeling that this person wants to come in and you know rescue you in some way because it's it's like you know they feel that um you know they have so much hope with this connection i feel they constantly think of how they can rescue you how they can uh you know uh, make you feel as though you are uh you know the most important person in their life like they dream about this they dream about the time when they can do this with the star card i feel that you know maybe you guys are in separation um so that's the reason why you know uh maybe due to some external reasons i feel so this person it's like you know they're waiting uh for they keep dreaming about a time they have hope that there will be such a time where they will be able uh to remove all your fears you know to help you relax to let you be this beautiful person uh that they see you as all right they're dreaming of being almost like a knight in shining armor okay um i feel also that this person with the star card they have been dreaming about you for a very long time you know it's like they probably liked you for a while and uh, i don't know why they they might have expressed it they might not have and i don't know what is the energy here what is the situation here rather but i feel that this person has been hoping for you like you know they're hoping that you know they could have you uh, in their life that they could be that knight in shining armor for you and i do feel this person has been you know dreaming about you for quite some time and with a lot of hope you know there's a lot of positivity and hope and i don't know maybe this person has been a secret admirer or something like that so i am getting that kind of an energy and this is also a number 8 card which is an eternity card so yeah there seems to be some energy of this person having you know been in love with you and dreaming about you for a very long time i'm also getting manifestation here you know with the star card here it's like they have this goal about you so they're very sure that you are the one and they're very sure that you know um that they want you okay so they they've been very sure they've set that goal and they're hoping that that it comes true okay now with the two sixes once again i i am seeing six is a number of love so you know there is you know that that love energy here that there's a very calm quiet a uh, peaceful uh balanced kind of energy that i'm seeing now what else do they dream about i don't know this is so funny i'm seeing this card <laughs> uh it's like they find you so beautiful i mean i don't know i just keep getting with the empress and then this six of pentacles this guy is actually painting uh you know this lady all right so it's like this so mesmerized by your beauty that you know they would like they would even they <laughs> sorry i'm uh talking too fast i think uh so i feel okay that they are so mesmerized by your beauty that they would even like to like you know maybe paint you or or you know have some sort of a picture or portrait or something that they could make of you to kind of express um you know how beautiful you are this person finds you very beautiful pile to okay there's just something about this all right they just feel that you're this beautiful flower sort of feeling that i'm getting it's like they want to literally like admire your beauty all right uh <clears throat> they are quite mesmerized by your looks okay uh and they seem to be dreaming a lot about them also now with the six of swords i'm getting that this person also dreams uh about you know like spending time with you you know like away from the crowd i feel you know it's like they just want you to themselves all right um it's almost like these two people are sitting together with their hands on each other so i don't see you know a very aggressive vibe here it's like 
it's very gentle and beautiful love they want to take it slow uh, they want some physical contact here but they want to take it slow because i'm seeing these two people like holding hands away from the crowd okay and then we have this two of pentacles here where this boy is actually kissing this girl okay and it's a very sweet energy you know it's like they don't want to scare you off because they think you're this fragile beautiful creature and you know they don't want to scare you off they you know there's a very there's a purity to their love all right um it's like i don't know like i'm getting this feeling that they dream about just getting away from the world <clears throat> with you to a, to some place which is like quiet you know far away from the world far from the madding crowd you know where they can stay with you forever and ever in peace that is their dream that's their big dream i feel with the empress card i also feel that you know uh, this person wants to uh you know have a family with you they want to see you as the mother of their children as well all right uh it's like they find you the perfect mate and they respect you i'm getting a lot of sense of like respect here so it's like they're dreaming of this calm quiet beautiful uh you know uh life in the future uh when you are with them uh and they want to like steal you away uh they're dreaming of stealing you away from everything and everyone so that they can you know have you in their lives and i sense with this fear card i feel maybe you are in some stuck situations you are fearful of something maybe you've had bad experiences this person dreams of you know um showing you the light again showing you hope again you know showing you love again and that's why they're so gentle even in their physical expression of love they're very gentle i think even you know if they uh, think of physically expressing their love they're going to take it very slow all right it's it's just uh you know they have this very protective energy about you okay this person could be older to you uh or more mature uh whatever <clears throat> fits okay th this person is just basically and and the other thing that i'm seeing here is that you know nothing else matters to this person uh you know they just want you in their life they dream about having you in their life they feel that you know their life would be so much more enriched and so much more peaceful and hopeful uh you know if if you were there with them it's almost like i feel this person wants to steal you away from the world just to themselves like there's a possessive tinge here that i feel and um you know this person constantly dreams about your beauty uh you know how attractive you are how they can help you provide for you i feel they dream a lot about your personality as well because i sense that they feel you're very graceful very elegant and very gentle somehow and they find that you i, I don't know i feel that they feel <clears throat> they dream about you being the perfect spouse and they feel a lot of peace with you i feel i don't know if you know this person or are in relationship with this person but i really feel that they want they feel a lot of peace and healing with you it's almost like they you know dream of you uh, as being an angel in their lives as something that the universe has given to them as a blessing you know they literally dream of that i, I feel and um you know like this is pretty much what i'm seeing here with a uh, pile 2 i think this person really wants you in their life very much like pile 1 uh they dream about having a future with you which is away from everyone okay it's 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 a very possessive energy here that i'm getting uh they dream of just rescuing you from anything that you are stuck in they want to just provide for you they want to be gentle with you they want to nourish you and they want to want to give you a life of peace they want to give you a life of peace 
and um, you know where you, you you just have no fears anymore okay you just have no fears anymore they want to keep you in uh, you know a, a lot of the dream of keeping you in a lot of um, admiration actually constant admiration this is the typical kind of person who would constantly give you compliments or get gifts for you or you know get you clothes or something like that I feel okay uh, now I also feel that uh, you know they want to travel with you with the two of Pentacles I feel you know they also want to travel the world with you or places where they want to you know where dream vacations kind of thing they dream of that as well visiting places uh, with the six of swords and the two of Pentacles I do feel they probably might want to visit uh, vacation spots with you and um, you know experience life with you is what I'm getting here okay it's almost like you know they want to assure you that they will always be with you and they dream about doing that you know in these kind of ways so I don't know what the situation is with you guys but you know like I'm seeing so much beauty here so much beautiful things that this person wants to do for you very much like pile one but there is a knight in shining armor kind of a feeling they they dream of being your knight in shining armor pile too that's also one major thing I'm getting I'm seeing you as this damsel <laughs> and I'm seeing this person as someone coming in and trying to rescue you open you up you know uh, <clears throat> make you less scared you know in life about love so this is beautiful okay <laughs> all right so let's go to pile number three now okay so pile number three with the blue stone Ten of angels, a ten of cups. No, ten of swords, I think. Yeah. Hmm. Taking steps. The acceptance. Three of pentacles. Four of Pentacles, and um, nine or uh, nine, which is the hermit. Sorry, hermit. Right. Let's see. Okay, so pile number three. What is this person dreaming about you? I I don't know what is the situation here, but I am sensing with <clears throat> with the ten of swords here and the hermit. I feel that you know you guys had some sort of a separation or a breakup or something like that, and you know uh, this person is kind of like you know. Uh, I think they're thinking, see, you see photographs here, um, you know, this person looking at photographs and albums. So I think this person is dreaming, looking at your photographs and dreaming about you because probably you guys are not, in, uh, are, are not together or are in separation. All right. I mean, they are reminiscing about, reminiscing about, you know, um, how it used to be with you okay and this person it looks a little pained because of whatever happened uh, only you know best what happened but with the ten of angels here I feel that you know this is like there was a breakup and now this person is lonely and kind of goes into these dreams of when you, or memories you know of when you guys were together so yeah this person seems a little sad 
okay and i feel you know with the taking steps and the three of um pentacles i feel they want to now work step by step they're dreaming of uh you know like um working step by step to getting you back and building a firm foundation for your life okay um now i feel this person wants in terms of like dreaming uh i i feel this person wants to show off to you uh you know how strong they are okay so i don't know what is the situation here but i don't know there is this energy of this person uh you know trying to show you how popular or how strong or how um resilient they are okay maybe they want to impress you that's why they dream about you they they literally dream of, about like you know fixing things for you doing things for you even arm wrestling for you <laughs> in front of people there is a energy of you know wanting to show off here okay that's what they dream about in any case okay and they do feel that you know you they do dream about you um you know coming back to them i feel okay they do dream about you coming back to them they dream about maybe uh they think about um the fact that they will that that you think about them as well with this hermit card <clears throat> i also feel with the acceptance here um and I, if i pair it with um the taking steps card i feel this person is dreaming of your acceptance to come back to them and they're willing to wait okay they feel they they're dreaming about you taking steps towards them towards accepting them okay um so it's like i do sense here that you know there was something uh, that happened and you guys are not together but they are dreaming that you would unconditionally accept them at some point and this person seems like a very quiet kind of person so i don't know if they can even tell you about it and i don't know what happened okay but they really need your acceptance they dream about it you know they're uh their solar plexus or or you know there's a flame that this person is holding and there is a heart here so it's like their heart beats for you okay they 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 really are wanting they're dreaming of you know you taking steps back towards them they want to be your hero is what i'm getting okay and i really feel this person is not with you because with the four of pentacles here um i'm getting this person looking at you from a distance okay so this person uh is probably like you know watching you on social media keeping track of you having their eye on you you know and they find you very uh you know like this i think they find you very attractive as well there is passion here uh they just but there's this untouchable feeling you know like they can't approach you or something like that so i don't know what the situation is but they long for you i feel they they watch out for you they long for you they you know they they keep track of you and they find you so attractive so ethereal they dream about uh you know the time when you come to them and they can be your hero and that you can you know make memories together and put all the past behind <clears throat> they really feel that you know um they want they want you to notice them they want you to know uh you know that that they can provide so much to you this is almost like a castle you know so it's like this person wants to provide so much for you they dream of doing that okay and they dream of your acceptance as well i feel they want that flame of love to be ignited or reignited in your heart once again okay so this person really wants your love okay they dream of having your love okay they dream of um with these two four cards i feel the dream of stability okay but i think that's a very far cry right now right now this person is just dreaming about 
you know um you accepting them coming towards them and they being like your hero this is a bit of a childish energy i feel but well you know that's a it's a dream we are talking about they dream about this okay um i also feel that you know this person is quiet like i said and and i think that you know um they dream of of probably even taking pictures of you and preserving them you know um with themselves because you know they really do have so many feelings for you i am really seeing so much uh in these cards here and i really feel that you know they wish that you know you would notice this kind of love and probably that is the reason they want to show off a bit so that you can notice them <laughs> is what i'm getting okay so there seems to be a bit of a childish energy here but then you know this person is quiet they probably shy okay and so they have all these dreams all right so this is what i am getting for pile number 3 okay so if you like this person obviously if you're inquiring about this person you like this person i think you can take a step towards them they're probably even thinking of you taking steps towards them because they're so shy and reticent yeah i am also getting that you know uh, whatever the situation is whether it's a new love or it's someone you you know separated from they want you know they are dreaming about you coming to them because they are so you know Uh, reclusive they're so watching from a distance scared you know 10 of angels is also 10 of swords which is like you know they they they're really scared about hard of things ending they'd rather just continue this whole thing from afar than facing you telling you about your uh, their feelings and you saying no all right so this person is dreaming about you know you accepting them and coming to them maybe and they you know being your hero this is what i'm getting mainly for pile 3 <laughs> okay let's go to pile 4 Okay so pile 4 with the orange stone nine of angels commitment five of pentacles king of wands eight of swords and the release metamorphosis okay so pile number 4 okay so i don't know what is the situation obviously but you know this person is dreaming of some sort of massive change okay with the metamorphosis card i feel and the eight of swords here i feel you are probably trapped in some situation i don't know what it is maybe it could be another relationship maybe a marriage i don't know what it is but they are dreaming of you know uh you kind of breaking these this trap or these chains and you know everything sort of uh changing they are actually dreaming of that they are dreaming of you coming out of this trapped mentality and uh or trapped situation and uh doing it you know uh, like totally metamorphosizing yourself 
all right releasing the burdens releasing the trap they dream about this so i don't know what is your situation but you know they dream about this uh, i also see them watching you and with the king of wands here i feel they want to probably help you or initiate this metamorphosis in your life all right they want to be like your savior they want to be like your you know advisor your guardian with the guardian card here also i feel this person feels very protective towards you and that's why they want to like you know save you from whatever is happening possibly it's like you know you are in a pretty bad situation and they just want to come in and you know like help you sweep you away you know they dream about that at least with this king of wands i'm also seeing a lot of passion you know this person is very attracted to you uh and they're like very sure about uh you know very sure about you so all the piles i think the person is very sure uh, at least about something solid I, at least three piles i'm seeing so this person is incredibly passionate about you and they want to be your savior your guardian they want to protect you because i think you are in some sort of an issue or a problem or a trap obviously with the commitment card this person wants to marry you it's really very simple i mean this is what i'm getting okay this person dreams of getting married to you of being your guardian and getting you out of this you know uh, whatever situation whatever uh, you know chaotic situation you are in at this point okay now with the five of pentacles here i am not going to go by the traditional meaning here uh, i would go with the image and it's it's almost like this person dreams about you know like i don't know like carrying you or something or or making you know uh, you sit on their lap you know and have some fun around friends they want to show you off uh to the friend to to their friends and you know they want to make you laugh you know because i feel you're going through something really tough in life and they dream about being the one to make you laugh i sense to make you feel comfortable they dream of showing you off to their friends they dream of getting married to you okay they dream of being um you know the driving force of happiness uh in in your life with the king of wands and this person is very very uh you know like he they are very set in their intentions right this is not a person who waits around i think this person also has like you know has been like keeping a track on you with this card here i think this person has been keeping a track on you on how you are leading your life what what is it that you are doing um you know this person is like uh they're just like a guardian angel you know that's what i'm seeing it's like even if you don't know this person is almost like a guardian angel they are looking out for you they've always looked out for you or at least since the time that you know uh problems happened in your life i also feel this person um you know it is is incredibly like i'm seeing a lot of passion here but i'm also seeing that you know um they want to legally uh, get together with you this is what they're dreaming of you know to be your legal spouse to show you off you know to have parties host parties and all of that stuff yeah so they are like you know um really in the energy of uh sweeping you away from this problems and they dream about this they dream about just protecting you and um you know taking you away and being the king or uh, in your life as such yes so i i am pretty much like getting this from here um as far as their dreams are concerned so this is what uh your uh, person is dreaming about pile number 4 uh i also feel that there is like you know there is an energy of like um you know like something like they want to do this fast even with the release card it's like this person has been holding on to their feelings or their dreams for quite a long time and they're almost nearing like bursting point all right they feel trapped they feel trapped about not being able to express this to you so i don't know what is the situation here but they really um you know want to come forward i feel they will also with the the king of wands here 
this person is going to come forward in the future uh, with this dream of theirs for a commitment. I think this person is going to do that because this energy is building up for this person. All right, I don't think they can control it anymore. I don't think they are in the dreaming stage yet. This is not a dreaming energy at all. This is more of a doing energy and like as of yesterday. All right. So this person, you know, is probably going to, you know, do something, initiate something. I really feel that on, on a more commitment centered level. But as far as what their dream is, I really feel this person wants to commit to you, you know, uh, take care of you and uh, show you off like, you know, to friends and take care of you and probably even, you know, like, uh, I don't know, make you laugh or something like that, make you happy. The person dreams of making you happy, actually. So this is what I'm getting for pile number four about what the person dreams about. Okay, and with that, I'm going to close the reading. I hope you found it useful. And uh, <laughs> please let me know in the comments because this was an interesting one. Okay, bye-bye.